Hi there, my name is Kathy. Welcome to the Junk Shack, baby. In today's video, I'm gonna show you a couple little DIYs I did for an update in our bedroom. We got a new bed, so I thought I need to have a little tchotchkes here and there and some artwork. Someone gave me this canvas back in my storefront days. I spray painted it to look like this a long time ago. I have a large canvas that has been many things and painted many, many times. This time I painted it white and just threw some different tape stripes at it. I'm gonna paint it with the satin nutmeg. Just fill in all the white. Ha uh, freaking duh. I love this. The little overspray that happened even though I didn't paint it brown. I kind of edged it up here. Oh my God. I made a creation. And now for the lamps. Fun fact. These shades were pink. You can kind of tell inside. I painted them white, I painted them black, and then I painted them with that color. This is what happened. It was that dark, I swear. I coated them and coated them and coated them, and that's how they turned out. It does nothing to the trim on top, uh, but it made them tan. We'll see how it looks. I'll probably have to buy new shades. You can't reuse something six or seven times and expect it to look right. LOL. I don't know about the lampshades. I'm not sure about that dark trim around it. We'll see. I'm going to set them up and at least until I buy something. By the way, it's January, almost February. Here I am tying up strings of an old project I started last summer again. It's finally time to do the little tchotchke decorates. Just the little Valentine boxes from Dollar Tree. I'm gonna take the lid off, it's pretty easy. I'm gonna lift. If you're, care if you're not careful, you can break it off really, it's that easy. Kind of wiggle it through. Push them back in. This one's a little bit harder, but it does pop off. Then I take that and kind of push it back. I am using Rust-Oleum's two times cover with the primer in nutmeg. Another little Dollar Tree box. This is a little bit harder cardboard with the Velcro. I've put a piece of tape on my Velcro because I am about to spray paint it. So I'm going to attempt to take my, my little mailbox and I'm going to paint a stripe here and a stripe here fairly organically. I'm just going to try to cover the ends of each um, with my nutmeg, sat, this whatever it is, you know, nutmeg. And then right through the middle, I'm going to take this flat paint. It's a camouflage paint, this color tan, and go right through the middle. And it'll be two different colors, two different textures. We'll see what it looks like.
Okay, let's let that dry. Okay, I couldn't wait. There's a few runs. It is not dry, but I'm thinking maybe it don't need to be dry. Oh my God, I think I might love it. I'm that easy. They freaking look like pottery. I'm gonna touch up around these edges. You see the pink and get the top. Half my box flipped upside down because I'm going to attempt to keep the shiny paint, the satin, along the outside edges. I kind of am thinking about putting some beads or something along there. Kind of fancy it up. We'll see. I'm going to try just a couple of squirts right here in the middle because I really like that. <gasps> Gathered some supplies that I thought I might use for this project needed a way to be able to hang these on the wall. Now to put the little stickers on. It was a big sheet of them. I cut them all in strips. Got my handy dandy little scissors. I really, really like the fact that I can change these flowers out with every season or even every holiday. I have yet to buy new lampshades, but I am still looking. So tell me in the comments below, what did you think? All of these little DIYs were very affordable. Everything was from the Dollar Tree. Anyone can do them. And just those little things like that really made the bedroom feel brand new. Hey, don't forget to hit the like button. And if you really liked it, man, it helps my channel if you'd share this video. Thanks a bunch for watching. See you guys next week. Same time, same place. Junk Shack, baby.